Hi guys, welcome back to the Fortola Podcast. I'm Adir. I'm Saul. And today we're going to be ranking shoe brands. Okay, so let's get right into it. All Starting right. it off with Adidas. Beat That's going to be an S tier for me. I don't, I mean, I honestly don't really like Adidas. I feel like Nike is better. Um, I feel like Nike and Under Armour is better because Beat like their shoes like aren't very good for like running. Wow, that's crazy because I'm actually wearing Adidas right now. Adidas shoes and yeah. socks. And they're really comfortable, and I just really love Beat the shoes. They're the jump. most comfortable shoes on me, and they just help me run. So yeah. I would put S tier. What do you think? I think it's like B tier. I think I it's fine. average. Anyway, right. right. okay. next we have Asus. Um, I honest, I it's I think it's called Asus. I'm not sure, but I think, but I've seen Beat their um uh, running brands before. It's kind of like an off brand shoe. Like an off-brand running shoe, I feel like. Oh, I've never heard of it. So. You never heard? Of it? No. Yeah, but it's just like a cheap off-brand running shoe. It's not very good, so I would put out like D tier probably. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what that is. Yeah, uh, I can't yeah. really tell. Um. Yeah, let's just we could just it skip it. it. Yeah, we could just. Skip. All right. Yeah. Next, we have Converse. Um, I don't really wear Converse. Yeah, personally. same. I feel like their shoes. I like, feel like they're nice. But yeah, they're nice, but they have, like, bad ankle support. Yeah. Yeah. Because when I see them, Beat when I see people wearing them, it's like, they look cool, but yeah, I wouldn't but, wear them. Yeah, so I think same. C-tier. They're not, like, for, like, athletes. So C-tier? Yeah. All right, next we have Fila. Okay. I think Fila's are really Beat bulky. Yeah. I just, I don't like they're the look They're very of them. heavy. Yeah, like, uh, I don't think Fila's are good. Like, nor do they, like, have a very good looks. Beat with yeah. And also, like, like, if you're, like, running around... And stuff like it's kind of a pain because like they're really heavy. So what do you think, D? Um, I think maybe C because yeah, it's better it's popular than it's too. Yeah. Beat with Kitchen. All right, next we have New Balance. Oh, okay. New Balances are I think I think they're really good because they're a good price and they're just you know good Beat shoe. With Kitchen. Yeah, I think I think they're a B tier because yeah, me too. they partnered with like Kawhi. So, oh really? Yeah, that's really good. So B tier. All right. But, yeah. Next, we have Nike S tier. Yeah, Nike is the best shoe brand. The most brand. popular shoe brand, probably. And it's, yeah, and it's the best shoe brand. They partnered with like, LeBron Beat and um, lots so of, many people. Lots of sports yeah. athletes. Yeah. It's a really good brand in general. I've purchased a lot of Nike shoes myself. Yeah, same. They're so, the best. Next, yeah. we have Puma. Um, okay. Um, I think, uh, I feel like Puma, to me, is just like an off-brand shoe company. I, I don't really like it. Yeah, I think. I think it's it's good, but I feel like it would be, you know, it's it's just a normal normal shoe. Yeah, it's not very good in my opinion. I think like Beat with good chance. I think like C, it, C or B. Yeah, I there I think they're for like soccer, probably. Right. <laughs> I don't know. Beat okay, with so right, next. Uh, next is uh, um, uh, do you know that shoe brand? Mm-hmm. Uh no, I can't really tell what it is. I think it like starts. I don't know. I just think it has D. Okay, right, Skechers. Next Skechers um, bro, Skechers, Skechers are like the ultimate first grader shoes. I mean, yeah. if you still wear them, they're fine, but they're more common um, for Beat younger people. Chum. Yeah, and also Skechers are are like very cheap. They're, I mean, like uh, they're very cheap and uh, like they're not hi- like very high quality shoes. So I think like I think D. I think C tier. I think they're D. still popular. It's a really popular brand. Yeah, they are popular, so but C-tier. they're just low quality. C tier. I Under Armour, you're wearing some yeah. right now. That's I'd crazy. say I'd say S or A tier. They're underrated. I think I think A tier because it's yeah. a good sports brand. But yeah, it's uh, you know. Yeah. But it, the thing about Under Armour is that they like have very good value. Like their running shoes and like tennis shoes are like fifty bucks, and they're just as good as like eighty dollar Nike ones. Yeah. Okay. And Next. also like their basketball shoes are like way cheaper. All right, next we have Vans. Vans is a really good brand. Um, it's really popular. Yeah, their slip ones are really comfortable. Yeah, it's really versatile too. There's like a lot of different styles, and yeah. So, what do you think? Yeah, I I think that uh, like their slip ons are really comfortable, but like their tennis shoes aren't very good. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So they 
Yeah, I, I think it's a good shoe brand. Hey, I, I do like gay. Hey, all right. Yeah. Mm. All right. Okay, so hey, with Kit Chan. Um this uh, so let's let's review this real quick. Yeah. Um Okay, so first uh Nike Nike S tier. Made with Kit Chan. Alright. Uh what do you think about that? Yeah, so I think a Nike at S tier is good. Um uh, Adidas Under Armour and Vans at A tier. Um, uh, that's fair compared yeah. to all these other things. I think it's I mean, yeah, like you you really like Adidas, but and then a B tier is a new balance um, um uh, so yeah i think a new balance is uh, i mean it's okay to be honest with Kit Champ. um uh, and i think you said yeah. they, they they partnered with Kawhi, right yeah no yeah. no i think um, <laughs> i don't think they uh made um, with Kit Champ. collide with anyone i think they I'm did partner sure. with Kawhi. did they remember their commercials that was good they all um Puma also um, combined it with Lamelo, and they made the Lamelo ones. Oh yeah, that's true. Sure, yeah, it. yeah, I've seen those. But there, but the thing is, is that like Bank other than that, Puma chum. is not a good shoe brand. So that's fine. I yeah. think Puma should be up a little bit, and so should Adidas. Nah, nah. And that was our special guest, yeah. Yusef, uh, tuning in, just yeah. giving some insight yeah. on this um, rating. Yeah, if you go back, he was in the ranking NBA team's hey, episode. Okay. So, at C tier is uh, Con Converse, Fila, Puma, and Skechers. That's, yeah. That's I, feel like, I feel like Skechers needs to be a hey, C tier. It doesn't I know. Belong I think it belongs Puma. C tier because mm. I think Puma should be put up. To be tier, and and then, if you guys say so, I should. think so yeah. because really and you, you do you agree, Yusef, that Skechers should, should be C tier. Yeah, that's a pretty good. C and these last three things, um, we don't really know what they are except Asus. Yeah, and Asus is just like off brand. I don't know about y'all, but I think Converse should go up one, and Show should Adidas. And so should. No. no. I think Adidas should be S. By majority rules. But I'm gonna keep the Converse at C tier. Yeah, same. because Adidas and Nike are the most popular shoes. You can go around and see ninety percent of people wearing those. You don't yeah. think you don't think about the Converse? Converse? No, no. Converse, Converse, are... is, Converse is horrible because they their shoes have horrible ankle support, and they I don't think they look very good. Yeah, okay. I agree. I agree with okay. you guys. All right, mm -hmm. so um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to check out our other podcasts. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and have a great day. Bye. Tidges.